Hey man, stop trying to fight everyone. Just ask them if they want to race. Yeah, I'll pass. I left my Centenario in my other pants. Oh, look at me, I'm Nolan. I got Centenario pants. James? Nolan? I thought it was you two. Welcome to Mexico. Hey, nice to meet you. Yeah, great to meet you in the flesh. Wow. I've seen you jump cars out of planes and that thing in the sky. How does it even stay up there? Calm down, fanboy. <laughs> you know Horizon. Haley didn't tell me you were coming down. Yeah, we heard the festival was here, so we brought the whole crew down for the weekend. J. Crew. And Nolan. <laughs> I'll look for them around the festival. Nice car, though. This yours, James? Yeah, it's mine. Sweet little personal ride with some uh, personal modifications. This is usually where someone has me the keys. Just be careful with it. I've seen you drive, too. You know what? I think I'm just gonna go with you. <laughs> Fanboy. Right, let's see what this could do. Hey, whoa, take it easy. Zach just finished fixing this thing. Uh, guys, I don't mean to alarm anyone, but we've got a dust storm blowing up along your route. <laughs> perfect. What? No, not perfect. Not perfect. In 200 yards. Turn right. Feels good. Let's see if we can find some dirt to tear up. Not too much tearing it up, though, right? <laughs> Trust me, James. Well, you're literally inside a sandstorm now, so have fun, I guess. No, Nolan, it's fine. I wanted a new paint job anyway. So, uh, you're just driving me out into the middle of the Mexican desert. <laughs> Don't worry, James. There's a beetle I want to show you. I'm kind of relieved. I gotta say, I'm kind of relieved. Yards, turn right. Turn right. Back on the road! This thing can't! Is this the first car that you've driven? It is literally way faster than it's supposed to be. I just love how much history VW has here, though. It all started with this guy, Prince Alfonso de Hohenlohe. He was a friend of Ferdinand Porsche. Anyway, our guy, the Prince, entered seven Volkswagens in the 1965 Pan Americana. None of them finished first because, you know, duh, 1.2 liter engine. But those seven Beatles, they all rolled over the finish line like a parade at an average of 61 miles per hour. There were two Ferraris that didn't manage that. People said that old Ferdie had smuggled in some Porsche engines, so they had to get a consultant from Houston to confirm that the cars were legit. Our boy Prince Alfonso opened his dealership later that year, and the rest is history. yards. Turn left. What am I looking at? This is the uh, Hyper Vocho. Alejandro says it'll do over 200 miles per hour. I'm not sure how that's even possible. <laughs> Alejandro built it, that's how. 
Should we take it for a spin? Don't look at me, man. You're the one who gets paid to be a passenger. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go. Right. Keep your speed up. I'll call the route. Road's technical ahead. That opens up. I'll call it when you can for it. Okay, right is easier, but both ways work. You decide. this before, right, Nolan? I'm okay with it. Because that's what I am. Okay. Okay, just let me uh, catch my breath here. You know, I've got an idea. If you're not doing anything tomorrow, let's build a car. You up for that? Absolutely. I'll see you at the test track at dawn. At dawn? Why? I mean, yeah. See you there. Welcome back, Kendall. yards, turn sharp right. Turn sharp right.
have arrived at your destination. some of the logistics, it's going to be a good one. Go on, amigo. I have everything ready for the next qualifier. Now, where is my future Hot Wheels legend? On my way. yards, turn sharp left. Turn sharp left. have arrived at your destination. So, you'll be racing head-to-head -head against a special guest in this. Chupan, 3.3 liter twin turbocharged. You ready? Stop! 
special guest. Okay, let's go. Huh? Oh, just somebody I could get at short notice. But the car. Based on the model Vern Chupin used to win Le Mans in 1983. I think he looks like something from the future, don't you? I was talking to Haley. We thought a high-speed run through the desert canyons, just like in Star Wars. Surprise! I'm not about to miss out on the chance to race a future legend through the canyon. <laughs> what my little cousin means is he begged me to bring him along. Luckily, I was feeling generous, and he is a worthy opponent for you. So, it's a Horizon Mexico legend versus a future Hot Wheels legend through the canyon. Beat Rami, and I'll put you through to the next round. Looks like I'm standing between you and your legend, my friend! See you on the finish line! <laughs> Not for long, Remy. Angelica Garcia on Horizon XS coming to you live! Ramiro's lining up against our top festival superstar! Who's gonna win? <laughs> Let's find out! Can you tell me how to improve if you win? <laughs> Horizon! Angelica here again with an update! Festival superstar is in the lead so far! Not that I'm biased or anything, but vamos, Rami! Mexico's counting on you! <laughs> You're giving me some competition here! Face Arena interrupts your regularly scheduled bangers to send a message to Rami. Currently trailing in the qualifier. My friend, I know this thing is only half over, but if you lose, your little cousin will never forgive you. Ha! <laughs> Leave this to the real racers! I'm not losing. I'm learning. Hey, Chris! Ravi V Superstar! Who you got? Superstar all the way, thanks. You owe me lunch. Hasale upgraded your engine without telling me? <laughs> my friend. If there is going to be a legend above Mexico, I'm glad it's you. Let me get this straight. You beat Rami in a head-to-head. -head. Oh, now that's definitely legendary. I think it's worth expert rank in the academy, don't you? Updating your schedule. Got another event set up. Something to help you understand the ultimate thrill for a hardcore Hot Wheels fan. <laughs> Thanks, Haley. Sounds good. Here, I'll upgrade your license to expert rank and for faster vehicles. You've earned it. Plus, I have some more ideas for missions. You're gonna need the extra power. <laughs> <laughs> 